well. I think I know what these keys are for. They're for all the different interactive activities in here. The first one we did right over there was to try to get that Goomba uh, rolling off the hill. I was, uh, we were all successful at it. Now for this one, uh, we're gonna try to get through a maze before this piranha plant over here wakes up. And uh, there's uh, timers right over there as you can see. It's kind of like the, uh, it's kind of like reminiscent of the old uh, game Don't Wake like Daddy. I don't know if you guys uh, remember that. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, like, that, that was an old game. No, that, that, that's just a game of chance. Yeah. <clears throat> but I think this one, this one involves more luck. This is more like uh, that stupid Mario Party game where you have to hit the button before the button. Oh, you mean Don't Wake like Wiggler? No, 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 no. The, the it's reverse bomb. That's what the reverse bomb. Yeah. That's what it is. Okay, yeah, from Mario Party 4. Right. Yeah, and uh, we actually played Mario Party uh, 4 for a few weeks, a few weeks ago. I do have uh, footage uh, for that recorded. I did. Yeah, I did record that. You'll be seeing those games on some Mario Mondays videos pretty soon. And uh, but yeah, this activity looks like it'll be uh, fun. And, uh... It's a nice shot of yeah. the fence post you had going on right there. Yeah. <laughs> and, as uh, Jay pointed out to me earlier, there are some uh, Pikmin, actually, in the background right over there. Steve the Pikmin lives! <laughs> That's specifically for children. You probably won't watch it, but I know he lives there. <laughs> Anyways. And then, of course, there's more time that's right over here. And, uh, yeah. So, this looks like it'll be another fun activity. It involves some luck and some skill, in my opinion, but we'll see what happens. I'll catch up later.